Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel Technocats. In this video, we will see the functions of GT Designer or you can say uh, Mitsubishi HMI GOT. So let's get started. New project. Next. So we are using GT27 here. Next. Control type is IQF. Next. 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 Finish. <coughs> so, uh, let's discuss now about the numeric input with the offset value. So, that is the numeric input here. Numeric input, uh, let's suppose D10 is the my numeric input and uh, style can be thing, okay, extension. So I am using here the offset like uh, D0 is my offset here. So anything value in D0 is my offset. Click OK. Now once again I need a numeric input for D0 that is my offset value so what is going to happen is that uh, suppose if my value of t0 is 0 then when i input some value in this d10 uh, input register so it will the value will move to d10 only but if my offset is 1 then the data will move to D11. If my uh, D0 is or uh, my offset value is 3, a 4 or 5, if my value is 5, then in the value I will enter in this uh, in numeric input will transfer to 15 number. So this is how it works. So now let's make some drop down list for this. So I'm making new window screen uh, that can be selection. Okay. Screen size just can be one twenty and uh, two hundred. Okay, here yeah, two hundred. So okay. Okay. Now let me use one word switch. That can be style will be none. Text can be so let's draw one section. Okay. I name it as one. That is T zero and the value is zero. Okay. So now let's copy paste this whole thing. And again, probably it is here value one. The text will be two again for the same for the next one. That will be three. This will be four. So okay. Now let's move to this here, and uh, we'll use one comment word comment display. Okay. 
shape can be any one you can use this that is the zero comment for one that is Click OK, yes. OK. Let me use one switch. It is a reverse switch. Arrow. It can be this. Screen switching. Okay, number one selection. Okay, okay. Now let's simulate this. So this is the PLC dot testers. This is my simulation window. Now this is the offset value. Okay. So suppose one. That is zero. Let's use two. That's one. Use three. Use two. Use four. It's three. So let's start with zero. If I input some value like ninety-eight and press enter this value 98 will move to d10 but if i change the value to 4 here and write some other value like 75 756 3 and press enter then this value will move to 103 oh sorry 1313 that is for the uh, offset value of 3 now again if i use like 3 here and uh, let me insert some value like 45 and I press enter this value will move to plus 2 offset so this is the use of offset actually uh, you can use it in various applications where you require some kind of this kind of uh, uh, you know uh, function 